hello everyone and welcome back to my channel it's queen of queen she me and today i'm coming to you guys with a quick and simple nighttime routine that i do primarily when i don't really feel like being bothered with my hair as you guys can see i had just have it up in a simple high puff today is day one of fresh hair so i definitely want to make sure i preserve this hairstyle so what i'm doing is i'm going to take down my hair band my elastic band I got these hair bands from Sally's. Like, oh my gosh, you guys, like these things are fucking dope. Like, they really have a lot of elasticity to them. So you will have to stretch them out if you're wanting a really stretched out elastic band per se. Um, but for the most most part, these are really, really, really good hair bands. Like, I'm definitely gonna keep repurchasing these from Sally's. The first simple step that I'm gonna share with you guys is just simply using my silk scarf. Um I got this silk scarf from my aunt. She gave it to me as a gift and I have been using it ever since as a night scarf. So what you want is to have all your hair go to the front. That is the goal. You want it to pretty much go up into a pineapple. So we're going to be doing the pineapple method. So I just like to get my scarf into a triangular shape like this. It probably doesn't look like a triangle to you guys but <laughs> I wanted to get into a triangle shape and I just simply take the scarf and I just take the flat bottom part and I just make sure that it pulls up my hair in the back so I'm just gonna show you guys so now that we have the scarf pretty much over the back part of the head I'm just gonna simply bring the two to the front just like that and I'm gonna take my hand and scoop my hair up so not to smooth the hair down but just to get my hair to just go forward into a pineapple so I'm just gonna do that all the way throughout the back and your hair should pretty much still be in that same shape from when you had it up in the high puff so I'm just gonna do it like that make sure I get this other side so I want my curls to preserve baby so as you guys can see all of the curls are to the front and that's what we want so you just want to make sure that you would just pull this forward and you don't want to tie your scarf really tight in the back because again you don't want the curls to actually flatten <laughs> you just want to make sure you preserve the style so I just simply make sure I have all my hair up out of the way I overlap the two ends of the scarf and I just bring it to the back and I simply tie it into a bow in the back. And honestly guys, this is what I do on those nights when I don't feel like being bothered with my hair. And I'll just take this part and just lightly tuck it. Because I don't want to smush the curls. So if they fall out in the middle of the night, that's fine. This is going to help to ensure that my actual curls are not laying flat. So this is the pineapple method. within having the elastic hair bands you're simply going to section your hair into four sections so we're just going to take this back down because I may go with that method tonight I'm not quite sure but I think I'm primarily going to go with this method for tonight so what you want to do is you want to have some elastic hair hair ties that you have been using and you want to make sure that they are pretty much stretched out you don't want them to be like freshly tight like out the pack so we're not going for a definite part we're just trying to separate the hair where it naturally wants to so that's what you're going to see me do here as you can see i still have my part from when i actually sit and style my hair and then i'm just going to go to the side and slowly separate my hair where it naturally wants to as you can see So, I'm just going to take the section. Let me zoom in some. Okay, so we're just going to take the section of hair and I'm just going to grab it. I'm going to grab it gently. You don't want to tug the hair. You don't want to stretch it out. You just want to preserve the curl. So, I'm just going to take the hair band and wrap it around once at the root. 
and then you want to kind of slowly bring it up so that way it kind of slides down and then I'm going to twist it one more time and then I'm going to put it on the ends just like that some people go for a really straight like you know really straight but primarily for me I again just want to preserve the curls so that's the main focus here so I'm gonna do the same thing on this side and we're just gonna separate it where it naturally wants to just like that and you see how it's just my hair just separates where it wants to so I'm just gonna grab the hair section take my elastic hair tie and then we're just going to start at the root as you can see we're going to twist once and then we're going to make sure that this band is kind of slid up and then twist twice there and then we're going to twist one more time at the ends just like that so now we have two of them two of them just like that and it looks crazy but i'm telling you the next morning when you just slide them off and you kind of shake your hair around you can decide on whether you can restyle it as just a regular twist out or you can pull it back up into a high puff if you would like to it all depends on your preference primarily and then i'm just going to do the same in the back it you guys and then I just simply slap on my bonnet um I do plan on investing in a better bonnet than this one that I have on right now because <laughs> this bad boy is looking funky but yeah you guys that is it that's pretty much what I do for my hair at night and then the third step if I don't want to do the pineapple method with the scarf or actually do the um, elastic band method where you wrap it around each section you can actually sleep on a silk pillowcase that's what I'm trying to tell you guys <laughs> so you can actually um, sleep on a silk pillowcase at night I actually do that too even though I sleep with a bonnet I still sleep with a silk pillowcase and plus too it helps with my face as well without with all the oil and all that good jazz so I hope you guys enjoyed this quick video because I thought well I'm fixing to sit up here I've already filmed one video and the camera was still set up so I would just share this with you guys as well so I hope that was really helpful for you guys because I know when I first went natural and I had put all that hard work into getting my hair looking like mad fly so I can be fleeked out the next day after I take down my own um, chunky twist and then I'd be struggling at night trying to figure out how am I going to preserve the style <laughs> or do I have to retwist my hair again at night like nobody has time for that okay so I hope you guys enjoyed this video my king and queens if you did please give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and comment down below if you have a different preserving method for like your hairstyle at night sound off down below in the comment section you guys and I will see you in my next upload be blessed my king and queens